How's that swing feel from a position standpoint at about 80 yards? I mean, it feels pretty good. Um, that looks pretty good right there. So that arm's just a little bit past parallel, your left arm. From like right here? Mm-hmm. Okay. Remember, I think that's about where you want to keep it, right? From what we said last time? Yeah. And then just accelerate through it. How was that one, distance-wise? Pretty good. It's, it's there, but for some reason I want to hit them all to those mounts. I don't really know why. Now again, if you if you feel like you get a little bit off just with your alignment, first check your alignment. Yeah. You know, make make sure you're aiming better. You know, get get back to using some sticks. You just have to adjust a little bit because, I mean, if you start to throw it too far open to try to keep the club face more square because it was getting more shut. Yeah. You know, if you open it up, then you're going to take some, yeah. some power off of it a little bit of distance. Right yeah. So. Let's watch that club face sit down there. Better alignment. That was better. I mean, the easiest way to talk through this, too, is for every degree that you open the club face to offset it, you have to aim left. Yeah. With your feet. You see? Yeah. Now, as you come closer to the green, doesn't make as much of a difference as, you, as opposed to if you're trying to hit it 60 or 70 yeah. yards. It's like yeah. a bunker shot. In a bunker shot, what do you do? You aim more left, and you open the club face up, yeah. and those angles equal straight. I'm trying to square it up. Take it back halfway and stop. Okay, it's toe up. Toe up is going to keep it as square as, you know, as you want it as square as you can. I mean, I don't mind it being a little closed or a little open. A little bit. If it's a little bit, that's okay. okay so just about, oh, maybe five yards right. Yeah. Square the blade up just a little bit before you go. Just you're gonna feel like again, just tow it in slightly. 